Discovery. working with this group I love Denise I just Denise I just said you really forced them to sing grabe naman yung trained <laughs> trained for dati kasi they just relied on plus one eh ngayon there's no more padding oh, absolutely good. no more padding good good okay How does it feel to come back to the role four times now? Well, it's always uh, an honor to, to, to do a role that is so close to my heart and with TP because I started uh, my professional theater with Tangana Pilipinas. So it's a parang homecoming for me. Dito kita una na panood. Yes, uh, walang sugat. Walang sugat. Hindi ko na panood ng walang sugat. Dito ah, talaga. Ah, so may oh, Yes, yeah, yeah. aside from that Disney one, dito ka talaga. So, yeah. what new things do you bring into the role? Yung anong learnings na dinadala mo ngayon? Kasi syempre nagbature ka na. Yes, so, mas um, alam mo ng problema sa bayan. Anong mga bagong dala mo ngayon sa role? Syempre mas ano, parang uh, I attack the role na mas human na si Aguinaldo. And uh, I think um, because parang yung mga ba si Monique. Oh. Si Miss Monique kasi grabe yung emotion niya when, when may scene. Siguro dahil talagang with uh, yung political ideas niya, lumalabas yeah. sa pagiging mabili niya. And then yun, mas nagiging ano kami. So that brings out a, a bagong response from yes, you? Yes, from Aguinaldo. Ganun. And then of course, um, lumalabas. Now, dati kasi ang take namin kay Aguinaldo was, uh, he was the president and general but he's uh, a little immature yeah. pero ngayon it's more like um, leading the country pero magkaiba kami ng ideas ni Mabini okay so parang I'm pushing the the leadership I'm pushing it here dahil I think this is right yeah. but Mabini has other ideas so nagkakaroon ng clash but ang, ang, ang direction was um, we feel the need to lead the country pero in our own yeah. um, in uh, parang way Kasi so you don't yeah. believe na selfish si Aguinaldo in his own way? I mean, well, there's a lot of controversy around him. There's a lot of... Kasi, tsaka, Pero you don't play him that way. Uh, I don't play him that way. I play the, the, the situation back then. Mm -hmm. Remember, during those times, it was uh, the war mm -hmm. against yeah. Spain. And then there's the Americans pa. Yeah. And then there's the Illustrados pa who was uh, parang uh, kinakausap si Aguinaldo na, Oh, kailangan magkaroon tayo ng sarili nating government. So, oh. yun, identity of the Filipinos, war against the Spanish, war against the Americans. So, Eh, ako yung president, right? So, yeah. all, all, all of those in my head. So, ima can you imagine the stress <laughs> yeah. sa atao? And Aguinaldo back then was just 30 years old. So, it's like, he's like my age. So, in, in, parang iniisip ko nga eh, paano pag ako yung nag-lead ng country, anong feeling? So, medyo ganun. Good. And then, the advisors are much older than me. I have Mabini. Yeah. And I have the Illustrados. Yeah. Ben Camino was there, Paderno was there, Antonio Luna was there. So, all of these opinions inside my head. That's why talagang hindi mo alam kung saan siya lulugar. And of course, siyempre, gusto rin niya na siya yung presidente. Yeah. I want it my way also. So, ang daming uh, conflicts dun sa... But I'm so glad kasi ang, ang dami na ngayon yes. na pag-isipan mo ng maigi. Yes. So, there's a lot. I'm sure yes. there's a lot na. Yes. But, uh, ang sabi ko nga, nung, nung inaano ko yung character ko, it's always the Aguinaldo as the leader. Yeah. Aguinaldo as the president. Yun yung gusto niya. Sinistir niya yung yung country dun sa gusto niya sa ino nga independence and then to have that republic talaga yeah. so break a leg thank you wait Haka kinakabahan na... ka pa ba? oo oh, poise na poise na nga ako <laughs> lalo na sa interview na to De, ano to ambush interview hindi ko alam kung ano sasabihin ko but yeah okay. so how do you deal with the uh, opening night jitters? Well, it's preview tonight, and but um, I think the the heaviest audience is tonight because it, they're family and friends and theater mm -hmm. friends also. So you know, people who really 
uh, listen and you know look at the show, enjoy the show. So ano naman, masaya naman. And uh, uh, kung stressful siya, ano rin naman, uh, masaya din dahil alam mo naman family siya. So you know, at home ka pa rin. Give it your truth. That's all you need. Yes. Thank you so much. Break a leg. Thank you. Hi, Sir Andy. <laughs> okay. Dapat ang question ko sa inyo, kinakabahan ka pa pa pag opening night? Oo oh, naman, sir. So, paano mo dinitil ang jitters mo? Uh, kailangan ko lang ng mga 10-15 minutes na ako lang mag-isa para ma-assess ko lahat kung paano yung ginagawa ko every show. How many minutes before the show? 15 minutes. Ayan. So, mga baka? Para sa akin. Alright now. So, kailangan iwan kita. Siyempre! <laughs> <Hi>! <laughs> Bob, short ang hair mo. <laughs> Here's Maria Clara now, Pabini. Ano nangyari? Ito'y pinagpanagawa nila sa akin. Oh my. So how does it feel to be back here the same bed? Pareho pa rin yung dressing room. This is your exact dressing room. Yes. So how does it feel? It feels great, exciting, thrilling. Okay, I'm supposed to ask you guys, opening night jitters, kinakabang ka pa pa? Of course. What makes you nervous? You know, this show kasi is about revolution eh. Tsaka tungkol siya sa pagbabago, sa kamalayang revolusyonaryo, all the changes. So, mas malawak yung reason na ginagawa natin yung musical na to. And syempre, as an artist, you want to serve the gravity of that. Yeah. And especially nowadays, when we have so much political repression and censorship and, you know, killings and all that, and artists and journalists, and everybody's already uh, not out of bounds na, di ba? Kasama, yeah. na, kasama na lahat dyan. Parang theater is that one of the last bastions na lang of truth-telling. Yes. One of the last places where we can still try to transform consciousness and still try to awaken people to the truth collectively. Kasi theater, yeah. you know naman, it's a collective energy. Yeah. So, so that's... So that, that's, it's that, not that, so much anymore about you as a performer, but kung anong, what you need to say in your yeah. work. Yeah, tsaka siyempre Mabini, historical to, di ba? He's a historical figure, he's a known figure, he's a well-loved and respected figure. Siyempre, gusto mong iserve the, the gravity and the dedication yung paglilingkod niya sa bayan. And, and, and then not only that, but how to translate that into now, where we have very similar people also laying their lives for... Um, for uh, you know the liberation of our country and our freedom. So it, it's it's a much heavier, ano, parang reason. Uh, you cannot just go into it as, just as a show. Yeah. Of course, you have to think about the technical, no? Right, right. Uh, this is probably one of the hardest shows I've done musically. Um, the music is amazing, but very technically challenging. Yeah. Um, the script is also challenging because yeah. the Tagalog is so beautiful and so really quite classical. But beyond that, ang gusto mo talagang iserve yung talagang the bigger picture of why we're doing message this um yeah. this show. We're almost what uh, forty minutes away, so I'm gonna let you be at peace. <laughs> Thank you. You caught me without my weight. <laughs> oh no, it's great. I mean, yeah. But yeah, you know, so. Thank you, well, and uh, thank you, Adi, because you know you really introduced Filipino theater to me. Iba, iba, iba talaga yung feeling, no? Yes, iba talaga, yeah. iba talaga. After so many decades of doing English-speaking theater, which yeah. of course honed us and yeah, taught yeah. us yeah, and yeah. fortified us and educated us, iba talaga yung nararamdaman ko when I do this show. It's it's very similar feelings to when I did Nolly and Philly. Yeah. Yung talagang story mo to eh, di ba? Lahi mo to, parang connected ka talaga dito sa story na to. So it's so... It, it's so purposeful and it, it's so soulful and means so much more. Parang kahit na maliit lang siya na contribution to what we can give to society as artists, it's still a worthy endeavor. No matter how challenging it is, it's challenging. It's maliit. You are giving so much, Mike. <laughs> you are the most, one of the most giving actresses I know. Thank you. And, and not just Thank about you. performance. It's just about your life and how you do it for Thank different you. causes. Thank you. You have been consistent throughout oh, your life. Thank you. So you've been... But you know, this company is also amazing and Chris and yeah. Tatan and Ding and the yeah. whole creative team. It's just in the ethos of yeah. what the show is about. 
the just the the freedom to be able to explore it, to personalize it, yeah. to connect it to the now. Because why are we doing theater? Kung di natin makakonect yeah. sa kasalukuyan. And now are perilous times indeed. And we need artists and revolutionary art more than ever before. So, and we need to really highlight our our, our artists who are doing that, yeah. creating this kind of work. It's, yeah. it's no it's no easy thing. So, do we expect more originals from you? Yes. Moving forward. Yes, yes. I think you know what you know. You know this, Audi. In in our, I'm turning 15 next year. Parang <laughs> there's so much you have, you also sacrifice to do theater, de ba? Yeah. Shempre, you have to live like a monk. You have to yeah. really like the extreme discipline that is required. And why would you do it if not not for a show that is going to? and then transform society. I wouldn't do it anymore if it was not for yeah, the reason. <laughs> I get exactly what you're saying. I'll in the streets. Na lang. Right. But if a show like this comes my yes, way, yes. Then, it's, then it's okay na hindi ako nakapagprotesta sa mga sa streets in the, in the last three months. We're doing it on stage. Yeah, we're doing it on stage. No more frou-frou, in other words. Yeah. Amanin yung ego natin. Oh, we're fed. Wala na, wala na, wala na we're fed. Na Time to, to, to yeah. give back. Yes. I love you. I love you, Odi. <laughs> <laughs> Go tonight, in Bali. I promise, I'll come back. Next week, I'll come back. cover ka. Oh, this is the other Aguinaldo. What's my kilt? Ah, huh? <laughs> kilt? From Sir Chris. Come uh, again, Sir Chris. Ako, EJ. Ah, uh, karon ka kilt. So, what, what, what new things did you bring to the role? Anong mga bago? Well, ito ang sung ginawa ko to was three years ago. So, uh, yung siguro yung ko as an actor also. Kumbaga, yung delivery of lines and the understanding of interpretation of the scenes. Iba siya. Uh, it's always better when you come back to a role, no? My, my... Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's my third time to do the role again. So, masaya. Maraming experimentation pa rin na <laughs> Easier vocally or... Maybe... Easier vocally, definitely. Kasi oh. nung dati, parang mas takot pa. Yeah. After three years, parang mas okay. Cool. Easy. When are you on? Tomorrow? Opening no, next night? Week pa. Next week pa. I see. Next week, we will come back. This week, we will come back. 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 We